Hello, in this session, we will create a simple colored glass material. First, we create a material. To create transparent glass, we set the blend mode to translucent and check two sided. Next, we create a Fresnel node. Using a Fresnel node, you can display reflections with varying intensities based on the viewing angle. Then, we create a divide node and a parameter node, and divide the Fresnel node by the parameter value to invert the Fresnel's gradient color depending on the parameter value. You can create a parameter node by clicking while pressing S on the keyboard. Next, we use a power node to give contrast to the gradient, and a parameter node to adjust the level of contrast. Then, to set a color for the gradient, we create a LERP node by clicking while pressing L on the keyboard, and connect the power node to the alpha pin of the LERP node to set the alpha area. Now, let's set the color. We create two constant three vector nodes by clicking while pressing three on the keyboard. Then we convert the created nodes into parameters and set the name and color. Next, we create a multiply node and a parameter node and connect the constant three vector node with them to adjust the color. Then we connect it to the lerp node to set the color of the gradient. Then we copy the nodes created before to the remaining constant three vector node, change only the parameter name and connect the nodes as we did before. We connect the LERP node to base color. Next, to give some brightness to the color, we use a multiply node and a parameter node to set the emissive color. Next, let's set the opacity. We create a Fresnel node and create two parameter nodes to be able to set the parameter value of the Fresnel node. Then we use a multiply node and a parameter node to be able to set the degree of opacity. Next, we set the parameter nodes to metallic, roughness, and specular, so they can be adjusted in the instance as well. Lastly, to set the refraction of the glass, we create a LERP node as shown in the video, and connect the Fresnel node and parameter node to the LERP node to create the reflection of the glass. In Place Actor, we place a shape mesh on the level. Then, in the detail window of the mesh placed on the level, we set the size and apply the glass material we created. 